It's a dark night to an old soul. You, you, you see the beacon of light through that black hole. Greetings, signs and moons. And of course, I have to welcome back all my stars. Any and all information that you need about me, how regarding this reading shall be in the description box below. Let go. Uh, so I'm picking up the energy of greedy. Somebody may see you as self-serving. You may call it independence. Following your dreams and or the dream state is significant. You may be a Trapflix content creator and or maybe you follow one. Now we have this energy of an Aquarius male, maybe female as well. I feel like this reversal has a lot to do with energy being sent back in regards to an investment. This King of Pentacles may or may not be an aspect of a Divine Masculine Emperor elect one. This could be an individual that wants to invest in you if you are a third party chosen one. I feel strongly this is a Divine Masculine Emperor Elect One's perceived right hand man. I'm also getting the energy of a third wheel. You may say they can't be a third wheel. I feel strongly this person may have mistaken your kindness for weakness or vice versa. Most definitely, this is a follower of yours and or my spiritual spouse. We have a Virgo female. You may have attempted to heal something with this individual. However, I feel like you picked up on someone's negative vibration, possibly even a pattern. Therefore, I feel a judgment call was made may have something to do with the Scorpio Sag cusp and or an individual sun sign Scorpio as well as Sagittarius. This could be somebody that you chose for yourself. This person may be somewhat new to spirituality and or a spiritual practice. You may know this about this individual Someone may need to check their sixth house placement. Maturity is also what I'm getting. Someone wants to feel useful. This individual may be over giving and or neat. I'm getting the energy of someone that is a neat person. May or may not be you. You may have gotten into a physical or verbal altercation in regards to someone's untidiness. Okay. Something or someone may have been wrapped up in a situation. This may or may not have something to do with an engagement. You may have witnessed something on social media. You can show me what it is I need to see. So here we have a Pisces male and a Leo male. Somebody may feel like someone is a coward. It could be two separate individuals or maybe you didn't trust your intuition in regards to someone's personal space and or patterns. You may be into sacred geometry. You may also feel like someone's keeping something hidden and or someone hidden. I'm also picking up the energy of someone being in collections. Now, you may be paying something off. This something has a lot to do with fiscal debt. You could be a business owner and or maybe you are in partnership with one. So speaking the truth with this King of Swords energy, could most definitely be Aquarius male. I'm also getting Justice League and or midnight league somebody could be into basketball this could also double as foul play either so here we have the hierophant may or may not be a taurus 
male. It could be a female, but this could be someone's value system. You may not see eye to eye in regards to a belief system. This could be you cycling out an old practice and or connecting with oneself. Someone could be attempting to study omniism. You may feel complete and whole on your own. This temperance in reverse is Sagittarius energy. This is giving me someone feeling conflicted about what may have taken place in the ethereal realm. The night sky or nightscape could be significant. I feel strongly someone is a gamer. You may feel like this person lacks maturity. So not being equally yoked could be of great significance for you. You may be questioning where a person is at. Someone may be attempting to study descension. If that is the case, this is something that you will not find located in a Torah. Zone one and or six is relevant to whoever is a content creator. I strongly feel that someone acquired a lot of physical debt as well as a financial debt somewhere around the 80s. You may be attempting to clear your credit or someone involved is. This could be an entrepreneur and or someone that wants to invest in your business. Now going forward, I feel like there's going to be a release in toxicity. This has a lot to do with the follower. You may notice that this person picks up on trends. You may also be aware that this person is undergoing some form of bewilderment. This could double as prying eyes. You may also feel like someone has too much time on their hands. If they show me what it is I need to see. Most definitely, this is someone that you blocked and or someone you are thinking about blocking. It may have something to do with the past person. This could be a child's mother and or a mother figure. You may also feel things got out of hand with this person, especially if this is an individual you share a dwelling with. May or may not be a child's parent. This person and or you may have been born in the years of the 80s. I feel strongly someone involved is seeking redemption. Now this could also play out as being compensated for a loss. Either show me what it is. So someone bringing you clarity in regards to a business venture is also what I'm getting. Most definitely, this is someone that you have a partnership with or you are weighing your options in regards to working with this person or they are doing that in regards to you. You may know that someone is a practicing sorceress, whether or not if they are a witch or Sangoma. This Sangoma could very well be a Sagittarius male. If that is the case, and this individual chose to go up against an elect one, then they may not be doing too well in regards to their finances. This is someone that has met their fate, especially since this individual is greedy. You could be seeing the number synchronicity 333 I feel like going forward, someone's going to opt out of working together in a partnership with an unlikely person. This person's intuition could be blocked, or maybe yours is. For some, this is most definitely someone that is not in your city. They may watch your content and or they may want a spot on your platform. Strong Sagittarius in this reading. 
going forward, I feel like if you choose to take accountability and responsibility for some sort of deceitful act in the past, your finances will be balanced out. Someone could see you as very judgmental. And if that is the case, you may have taken an unnecessary action in regards to some work or a prior engagement. I'm picking up the energy of something being bittersweet. You can show me what it is I need to see. You may feel like someone lacks patience in regards to a question being answered and or a response. Someone's ETA may be questionable as well. Either show me what it is I need to see. You may want someone to travel towards you. However, I feel like this individual is undergoing some sort of faded situation, especially if they fail to take accountability and or responsibility for a deceitful action in the past. This may be a person that repeats past patterns. If that is the case, they may be taking another trip around the karmic wheel, or you are. So lacking patience in regards to spiritual enlightenment, someone may have felt like they knew more than you or they knew a particular doctrine better than you. If that is the case, you may be going through some form of release in regards to tradition. Now, this could also be a release of a person. If that is the case, there could be a contractual agreement. I feel like this applies to both platonic and romantic. You may have felt like you could heal someone and or someone contracted a sorceress to do some form of bewilderment. So being enlightened in regards to situations and people from your past. People in the community or workspace may be telling untruths or gossiping. I feel strongly someone may have chose to not get married. You may be questioning where this person's whereabouts are or vice versa. You can show me what it is I need to see. A Scorpio male is most definitely involved, may or may not be an elect one. The years of the 2000s are significant for you and or maybe a third party. Could be this practicing sorceress. You may be questioning where a Libra is and or will something come full circle? You may know that this person operates in their shadow energy. If that is the case, they're registering as selfish. Again, your sixth house is significant. Most definitely, this is an individual that watches me. You may know that this person has seen my content. Either show me what it is I need to see. So the release of a Capricorn male. You may feel like this individual misjudged you. Or they feel that way about you. Especially if this is a child's parent. This could also be someone that wants you to have affection for them. If that is the case, this may have been an unrequited love situation. So in regards to a prophetic word. This person may feel like you follow a particular doctrine. However, I'm getting strongly someone is an omnius. This person may have also attempted to channel your energy with the pendulum. They may have asked, did you descend? This is most definitely a partnership that was not equally yoked. You may have felt like this person didn't pay attention to you or they feel that way about you. Someone may opt to find work in another city, especially if this individual 
is going through some form of legality. If you show me what it is, I need to see. May or may not have something to do with a Scorpio, male or female. If you are a divine masculine, emperor, elect one, you may have released this person from a prior obligation. You may know where this person is, but you're not saying anything. Or they're not saying where you are. You can show me what it is I need to see. So someone having a stronghold. This person may appear like they are innocent. This stronghold may be something that they keep secret. Ether, show me what it is I need to see. You may feel like this person's tick is laying down with you when they are under the influence. You may know that this person attempted to follow you around the internet and or they felt like you were their twin flame. So dressing up the issue is also what I'm getting. This person may feel like what they do is hidden. However, I feel like there's an individual that can see things for what they truly are. Now, someone may have been flirtatious with you in the past. This could be the person that felt rejected by someone that you may know. So a sweetheart is significant. Keys on a ring. Someone may be attempting to channel Papa Legba and or you or someone involved lost their keys and possibly a ring. So giving you your flowers is significant. This person may attempt to show up. I feel like they want to rehash a past partnership. If that is the case, you may feel like this person is manipulating you. For someone, you may know that this individual was involved in some form of binding. They may feel like they are a puppet master or you feel that way. I also feel like this individual feels like they have you on a string. So manipulation is most definitely on the table. This person may feel like they could have you whenever they want to. So lightning not striking twice in the same area is also what I'm getting. This could also double as tumultuous weather. You may feel that this is a tower moment, especially if someone doesn't show up. This person may have made a lot of empty promises. You may feel done in regards to this person. Someone does not want to let you go and you don't want to let this person go, especially if they are a Sagittarius, male or female. Ethan, show me what it is I need to see. Okay, so projection may or may not have something to do with sorcery. If this is in regards to a sorceress, this person may have attempted to project distorted energy in your area. They may know your whereabouts, so location is significant. Someone else may also be attempting to locate your whereabouts. I feel strongly someone's not showing up for work. This could also be someone that is malnourished. So feeling faint is also what I'm getting. You may have witnessed this person fall. Now this could be metaphorically speaking. Either they or you was involved in some form of betrayal. It may have something to do with a significant other, but I also feel like someone didn't show up for a date. Now this could be the person that has your key. You may feel like this person is egotistical, self-serving, self-centered, shallow. Maybe a fire sign doesn't necessarily have to be. I'm not saying that all fire signs are that way. I'm just saying that the person that you chose is. 
I feel strongly that this girl talk is happening in someone's environment, may or may not be their place of employment. This could also be small talk in the community in regards to someone that is MIA. You may know that this person is a player. They may have rejected your call or refused to come in your direction. All of those cards fell on the floor. So gaining clarity in regards to someone that you may be thinking about releasing. If that is the case, you may know that this is a karmic contract or they know that about you. I feel strongly that this may be a friend of me or someone that you may have some form of acquaintance with. You may know that this person is not a good friend. You may also feel like this person was with your significant other. So release of a person and or an outdated belief system, especially if this person's demeanor is cold, harsh, rigid. Yeah. I feel like this cassette energy is someone that feels like they can lay down with you whenever they choose to. This person may have also done this in the past to you and someone that you know. Being left at the altar is significant. I'm also getting bride to be. Someone may opt for a ceremony on a boat. Either you or this person is researching places to get married. I'm being guided to end it there. Deuces.